<laughs> That's my little brother. He's four. I'm supposed to watch him. He's kind of a pain in the neck because watching TV with him is a real bore. <laughs> Hear that? What are you watching, Wouncy? Little bunny wannies? <laughs> ordered his men to swipe King Trashola's daughter to make her his wife. <laughs> yeah, here is the barbarian you requested, my lord Trashola. Lord Ponscombe has swiped my daughter and only heir to the throne. My own soldiers dare not stand up to the scoundrel. Return Princess Ugg to me and... Ugg? Never mind her looks. Bring her back and I'll reward you with all the gold you can carry. You got it, dude! Later! And so began the quest of Savage Stewart. The garbage pale barbarian. But, as in all quests, one must journey through hazardous wastelands and engage in perilous combat. Why do you want to cross this pass? The usual reason to rescue a fair princess. Well, to get past me, you'll have to answer three questions. It used to be two. So, everything's gone up. Let's see, when was the color of Goulash the Terrible's black horse? Why? He spilled vanilla ice cream on it. Darn! So you've heard that one. Okay, who is buried in King Turlock's tomb? King Turlock! Hmm, think you're pretty smart, don't ya? Answer me this one. What is my name? I got a pizza for when I jack. Is he there? I'll jack. <clears throat> hey, is your name one I jack? Ooh, did you know? Pizza for one I jack? That'll be five dollars and thirty-five cents. Five and thirty and five makes what? No tip. The pizza's cold. Well, don't blame me. No tip of vulva. You seem to have no fear. Yeah? Well, I really get mad when I don't get a tip. Hey, listen. You want to go on a quest with me? I'm just a pizza delivery boy. 
Yeah, but we're gonna rescue a princess. Really? What's your name? Princess Ugg. Ugg. Yuck. Do you know her? No, but with a name like that, she's gotta be ugly. And so, with Corn Dog, his newfound companion, Savage Stewart continued his quest to rescue Princess Ugg. Our adventurers passed through the Black Forest, a place filled with scary stuff. The territory of a very mean bully, Galloping Glen, the centaur. Hey, you as scared as I am? I am Savage Stewart, the garbage pale barbarian. I fear nothing. Well, almost nothing. And what brings you to my realm? The usual. I gotta rescue a fair princess. If you want to get past me... I know. We have to answer three stupid questions, right? No. You have three chances to make me mad. Uh, does your mother dress you that way? Ha! If that's the best you can do, you'll never get past me. Well, is it true your mother wears army horseshoes? Yes, she does. Size 7B. Hey, careful. You might get a mad. Of course, fool. That's the whole idea. So, donkey breath. Donkey breath? I'll have you know I'm a thoroughbred. Ha! Now I got him! I missed! What am I gonna do? Have a pizza? Hey, thanks. Nice going, corn dog! And so Savage Stewart completed the second leg of his quest. But the scariest leg of all remained. I tell you, this Princess Bug has gotta be ugly. This must be the place, and this is gonna be our most difficult mission. I think I'll wait out here. Chicken! Piece of cake! Let me guess. You're here to steal the golden key that unlocks the princess's prison door. Am I right? Savage Stewart took great care to avoid Curly Carla's evil eyes. For were he to gaze into them, he would turn instantly to stone. Thanks for reminding me about the eyes. Hey, what are friends for? These guys are after the key, too. So what makes you think you'll succeed where others have failed? Well, I am Savage Stewart, the garbage pale barbarian. Oh, yeah, I've heard about you. You're even dumber than I thought. <laughs> And so, with the golden key in his possession, Savage Stewart could now rescue Princess Og and return her to her waiting form. I'm scared. I would be too if I wasn't so dumb. Remember, we gotta be silent and sneaky about this. I thought we were supposed to be silent. All us barbarians gotta give a loud war cry. <laughs> oh, hi! <sighs> Intruders! I mean, the sound of the alarm! Something's up! Check it out! To the tower, you fools! <sighs> She's in there, we're out here. Come in, it's open. <gasps> what took you so long? There they are! Come on! Judge! Oh dear, Lord Ponscombe's men. Let's go! Oh, oh you do that so well. I've had plenty of practice. 
You're the 12th man I rescued this month. your job well, Barbarian. Uh, uh, so please accept a kiss from my lovely daughter as a token of my sincere appreciation. Ah, oh, gross! more heroes that way. And so ends the quest of Savage Stewart, the garbage pale barbarian. Or does he? Join us next time for the revenge of Savage Stewart, the garbage pale barbarian, part 47. Kids, has this ever happened to you? No TV till you finish your homework. With the homework machine, that'll never happen again. I thought I told you, no TV till you finish your homework. But I did finish. Yes, you'll never again miss your favorite TV show when you have the homework machine. And now it's time for a garbage pail groaner. Class, class, come to order. It's time for your oral report on famous inventors. Now, who wants to be first? Me, Mrs. Gallagher. I read about a guy who was a fantastic inventor. Back in 1802, Waldo Sticko invented the world's most powerful glue. But nobody could ever use it. Why not? He couldn't get it off his hands. Ah! Taking forever to clean up these leaves with this stinky rake. There's got to be an easier way to garden. Fill her up! That's what I call teamwork. Before we know it, we'll earn enough money for Mrs. Slotnick to go to the rock concert. I hope so. But don't forget, she's real picky and she's got a nasty temper. What are you worried about? Everything's perfect. You call this perfect? Look what you missed. A weed. I hate weeds. My garden must be like my house. Orderly and absolutely spotless. Especially since I want to win first prize in the garden show. This is a very rare green bean plant, not a weed. <gasps> A rare green bean? Just what I need to win first prize. Oh, too late. You've already squished it. This plant food will save it. A little instant fertilizer, a dash of Jiffy Grow Juice. Ha <laughs> ha! 
<laughs> Go and get back!
my house, everyone knows it's spotless. But there must be some dust. If we can't find some, he'll eat your house. See for yourself. There's always dust under rugs. Wow! Where did that come from? I didn't put it there. This is a good start, but we're gonna need lots more. Great! Keep it coming! It is my pleasure to award you grand prize in the new category of the most beautiful exotic flowers growing on a former weed that ate up a supermarket. Thank you. Don't say anything about all my dust, and I'll split the prize money with you. Today's Garbage Pail Award goes to Carly Cuts. Carly's always cutting in line. Hey, look out! She's sneaky. On hot days, Carly takes it easy while others wait in line. Today's award goes to Carly Cuts. Oh, and one condition. We're making her wait in a long line to get it. Yeah! 